begins in Toronto. But tonight, it's the final pit stop on the road to the Royal Rumble. We are live from the Toyota Center in Houston, Texas, for what is going to be an action-packed Monday Night Raw. Thank you for joining us here tonight on your final Monday Night Raw before the Royal Rumble. And coming up in your main event, it's an all-star battle between the man who will fight Edge inside No Holds Barred at the Rumble, Kevin Owens, as he goes one-on-one -on -one with the original bro, Matt Riddle, who will build momentum for this Sunday. We find out later tonight on Raw. Well, we kick things off tonight in Houston, Texas with the World Tag Team Championship Eliminator Final. One of these teams will fight Damian Priest and Dominic Dijakovic this Sunday at the Royal Rumble for the WWE World Tag Team Championships. Eric and Ivar, the Viking Raiders, they have met Priest and Dijakovic in recent history. They want to run it back this Sunday night in Toronto. The following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 552 pounds. Ivar and Eric, the Viking Raider. The former World Tag Team Champions defeated Jinder Mahal and Sheamus just last week on Monday Night Raw in the Tag Team Eliminator to get here tonight. And you remember back on December the 7th at Raw Homecoming in Madison Square Garden, Eric and Ivar went toe-to-toe -to -toe with Priest and Dijakovic. It was one of the best tag team matches of 2022. They came up short in MSG on that night, but Eric and Ivar, the hunt continues for the World Tag Team Championships. If they can get through Johnny Gargano and Tommaso Ciampa here tonight, then they got themselves a first-class seat in Toronto this Sunday night at the Royal Rumble. This is going to be one hell of a way to kick off Monday Night Raw, your number one contenders matchup for Damian Priest and Dominic Dijakovic. Viking Raiders are set, and here comes the opposers, D-I-Y. And their opponents, at a combined weight of 400 pounds, Tommaso Ciampa and Johnny Gargano, D. So Gargano and Ciampa got an extra week's rest as it was two weeks ago on Monday Night Raw where they took on Kofi Kingston and Xavier Woods of the New Day in the Tag Team Eliminator. Remember what happened after the matchup, DIY using the New Day to set an example to the Monday Night Raw Tag Team Division, beating the hell out of them and throwing them out of the ring afterwards. Gargano and Ciampa, you may not like their egotistical attitudes, you may not like the cold-hearted son of a bitch in the blue right there, but at the end of the day, DIY knows what it takes to be at the top of the mountain. Former NXT Tag Team Champions, as a matter of fact, they won those NXT Tag Team Championships in the very building that we will be in this Sunday night in Toronto back in 2016. Will history repeat itself or will the Viking Raiders make their way through DIY tonight? Champa taking the fight to Ibar as we kick off Monday Night Raw here from the Toyota Center in Houston. Our final Monday Night Raw for the long-awaited Royal Rumble pay-per-view. Going to be our biggest event yet. It is a live premiere this Sunday night, New Year's Day, January the 1st. We are kicking off 2023 with a bang. 5 p.m. Eastern time. What a matchup, or excuse me, what an event it's going to be this Sunday night as the road to WrestleMania begins at the Royal Rumble. And who is going to fight Damian Priest and Dominic Dijakovic for the World Tag Team Championships? Will it be DIY or will it be the Viking Raiders? Eric. And Ciampa goes behind. Nice counter by the Blackheart Tommaso Ciampa. After losing the Intercontinental Championship back at Raw Homecoming, has found himself in yet another championship picture. Tommaso Ciampa has pretty much been in all winning ways since making his way to the main roster, as is Johnny Gargano since returning to the WWE. Gargano's 3-0 thus far, two singles victories, and of course the tag team victory with Ciampa two weeks ago. Since his Monday Night Raw return on the Raw After Survivor Series. Tommaso Ciampa, on the other hand, only one blemish on his record since joining the main roster in the Raw After Extreme Rolls back in August. Viking Raiders looking to make sure DIY is continuing their winning ways off their behalf tonight. Eric and Ivar won the World Tag Team Championships yet again back in March of this year. They held them all the way on June 26th at SummerSlam where they lost in the Dominic and Rey Mysterio. 
And the Viking Raiders have really been trying to get back in the championship picture ever since. They've had a couple of opportunities, unfortunately for Eric and Ibar, those opportunities have slipped through their fingers. They definitely took Dominic Dijakovic and Damian Priest to the limit a couple of weeks ago at Raw Homecoming. They may have come up short. Maybe a round two with Priest and Dijakovic is what Ivar and Eric need to correct the wrongs and walk out the World Tag Team Champions. Opportunity hangs in the balance here tonight. Still to come tonight from the Toyota Center in Houston, Kevin Owens, the man who will fight Edge this Sunday and no holds barred at the Royal Rumble, takes on the original bro, Matt Riddle. He'll be one of the 15 Raw superstars in the 30-man Royal Rumble matchup to determine who goes to WrestleMania's main event. I cannot wait to get to this Sunday night. It is a stacked card. We are going to run it down for you a little bit later this evening on Monday Night Raw. Johnny Gargano in there with Ivar right now. Obviously the smaller competitor, but Gargano knows how to chop him down. Gargano, a former NXT Grand Slam champion. You may not like his ego, but he certainly can't knock the talents of Johnny Wrestling from bell to bell. And Ivar doesn't give a damn about the talents. Ragdolling Johnny Wrestling here tonight. And a tag made to Eric Gargano going to crawl to the corner. Tag made to Champa. Two fresh legs in there in this number one contenders matchup. The finals of this tag team eliminator kicking us off with what is going to be an action packed night on Raw. And Champa laying waste to one half of the Viking Raiders. Short Priest and Dijakovic got their eyes locked on this matchup. Priest and Dijakovic not only will be defending the World Tag Team Championships, but from what I understand, will still, no matter the result, be two of the 15 superstars representing Monday Night Raw in the 30-man Royal Rumble matchup. It's gonna be a busy night for them this Sunday night, January the 1st, New Year's night, at the Royal Rumble. Now Champa continuing the beatdown on Eric inside of the ring. As we mentioned, DIY on the NXT Tag Team Championships in the very building that we will be in this Sunday. Wait a minute, Champa double knees to the back of Eric. And then maybe all she wrote, DIY, heading to the Rumble, not just yet. Eric gets the shoulder up, and wait a minute, Champa. And those are the tactics of DIY that you hate to see. But luckily, we don't want to play favorites here. But Champa getting a little taste of his own medicine, the psycho knee by Eric. Out of nowhere, and the Viking Raiders may have pushed their ticket to the Rumble, not just yet. We are hitting new waters in this matchup, laying everything on the line for a chance to go to the Royal Rumble. Wait a minute, Gargano had Eric distracted. Fairy tale ending by Champa. Into the cover he goes, but Ivar's in there to break it up. And I'm Champa with the neck breaker to Ivar. And this thing is starting to break down. It is a melee here in Houston. Champa going after Ivar, but that gives Eric enough time to get his wits about him. And has the momentum just changed in this matchup, and Champa trying to make sure DIY stays the aggressors. Now tag made to Johnny Wrestling. Johnny Gargano in here to represent DIY. Nice head scissors there by the whole shebang himself. Eric's in trouble right now. Gargano picking up Eric, cradling him up here. Down goes to the canvas. And back into the cover by DIY and a drop kick to the back breaks up the pinfall. Ivar saving the matchup for the Viking Raiders on a few occasions, but the damage has certainly got to start adding up for Eric at some point. Oh, wait a minute. Drop toe hold. Johnny Gargano lock it in. The Gargano escape, and Eric's got no choice but to tap out. The punishment building up maneuver after maneuver. And there's no way to go. There's nothing you can do in a maneuver like that. Johnny Gargano catching Eric in a dazed state. Gargano escape, locks it in tight. And DIY have just punched their ticket to the Royal Rumble. Here are your winners, Johnny Gargano and Tommaso Ciampa. Well, the Eliminator started with four teams, and it's now down to one. Those are your winners, and we move on to this Sunday night. DIY looks to become the WWE Tag Team Champions of the World when they take on Damian Priest and Dominic Dijakovic this Sunday at the Royal Rumble.
We're back live here in the Toyota Center in Houston. We are set for some women's division action on the road to this Sunday's Royal Rumble pay-per-view. Mia Yim set for a one-on-one -on -one affair here tonight on Monday Night Raw. And Mia Yim's opponent this evening, the number one contender for the WWE Women's Championship of the World. She'll meet Shotzi in Toronto on Sunday night. But tonight, a little bit of a warm-up match for the Empress of Tomorrow. Asuka! And from Osaka, Japan, Asuka! It is the third and final meeting in this long story between the Empress and the Ballsy Badass. Asuka, the number one contender, the women's champion, Shatsy, one more time this Sunday night at the Royal Rumble. Asuka and Shotzi's story began on June the 26th of this year, and what we thought ended back at Survivor Series with Shotzi finally toppling, toppling excuse me, the Empress of Tomorrow, Asuka, not to be the day as Asuka, of course, appeared after Shotzi's open challenge victory over Tegan Knox a couple of weeks ago here on Monday Night Raw, and Asuka really turning an ugly head, attacking Shotzi from behind, laying her out, and sending the message that she was not done with the ballsy badass just yet. You may not like the actions of Asuka, I certainly don't either. But at the end of the day, you're looking at one of the most dominant women in all of WWE history. And Asuka, I'm sure, looks at Thanksgiving night at Survivor Series as one lucky night for the ballsy badass Shotzi. Asuka looking to right those wrongs in her mind this Sunday in Toronto. She's got to stay focused here tonight. Mia Yim looking to make a name for herself on Monday Night Raw. Mia came up short a couple of weeks ago against Naomi here in the red and black ring. Looking to bounce back tonight against the number one contender, Asuka. And what a win it could be for Mia Yim if she's able to defeat the number one contender tonight. You got to think, regardless of what happens on Sunday, Mia Yim's going to put herself in line as the first challenger for the women's championship. Nice arm drag by Mia Yim there. I'm sure the ballsy badass Shotzi has got her eyes locked on this matchup. Shotzi will be in action later tonight on Monday Night Raw against Sonya Deville. Now Mia Yim, big boot in the corner by Oscar, or to Oscar, excuse us. Mia taking the fight to the number one contender, knows the opportunity that's on the line here. Asuka gets the shoulder up. Gotta love the heart of Mia Yim in this matchup. Now Moon Salt, very impressive there. Mia is one of the toughest women in the division. We have seen her go toe to toe with the best of them in NXT and here on WWE. Wait a minute, Asuka. Kick to the gut. Hip attack to Mia Yim. Stopping the momentum of Mia Yim dead in her tracks. And oh no, grabbing a hold. No waste in motion by the Empress of Tomorrow. Asuka lock is locked in tight. And there's nowhere to go. Asuka picks up the victory tonight on Raw. Well, Mia Yim brung the fight to the Empress of Tomorrow right off the get-go. But Asuka not wasted any time. May have just pissed off her opponent. Hip attack, Asuka lock, and Asuka's full steam ahead, heading towards Toronto at the Royal Rumble. Come on, Asuka, leave the ring. Come on, well, come on, the match is over with. This new turn of face by Asuka has been absolutely ridiculous. First the attack on Shotzi, and now beating down Mia Yim after the bell. An unnecessary assault, like it or not, but Asuka is heading towards the Rumble. Who is going to stop her? Well, the action continues tonight in Houston with a one-on-one -on -one affair between the modern-day Maharaja Jinder Mahal and Ilya Dragunov. Plus, the women's champion Shotzi set to go one-on-one -on -one with Sonya Deville. And the results of those contests see Ilya Dragunov picking off an impressive victory against Jinder Mahal and the women's champion Shotzi full steam ahead towards the Rumble as well as Asuka. She defeats Sonya Deville here tonight in Houston on Raw. And as we roll towards the 30-man Royal Rumble matchup this Sunday, every man's looking to build momentum, and that includes Cedric Alexander, who's looking to earn his spot in the 30-man fray coming up this Sunday night, live premiere at 5 p.m. Eastern time. The road to WrestleMania begins at the Royal Rumble. And his opponent 
from Battle Creek, Michigan, weighing in at 235 pounds, Rob Mr. Monday Night, looking to bounce back after his loss to AJ Styles a couple of weeks ago on Raw in the number one contenders matchup to fight Randy Orton on Sunday. RVD will be one of 15 Raw superstars to participate in the 30-man brawl that will take place in Toronto. Could RVD be the one heading to WrestleMania? I'm sure RVD is going to have his eyes locked on the AJ Styles, Randy Orton, WWE Championship matchup this Sunday. But Mr. Monday Night's going to be all focused heading in to the Royal Rumble match. RVD looking to build some momentum towards that matchup this Sunday. And as for Cedric Alexander, He's looking to bounce back after that loss to Karrion Cross a couple of weeks ago here on Monday Night Raw as well. What a night of action it has been thus far tonight in the Toyota Center in Houston. We want to thank you for joining us here tonight on Monday Night Raw as we continue on with Cedric Alexander versus Rob Van Dam. What a matchup this could be between two high-flying competitors. Still to come in moments, the prize fighter Kevin Owens takes on the original bro, Matt Riddle, in your main event tonight in Houston. And then looking to build momentum to their respective matchups this Sunday night in Toronto. RVD taking the fight to Cedric Alexander off the opening bell. Cedric's trying to build some new momentum for himself after the Hurt Business fell apart in the WWE Draft. Cedric here on Monday Night Raw, away from Bobby Lashley, away from Shelton Benjamin, who are on SmackDown. As we mentioned, Cedric came up short a couple of weeks ago against Kerry and Cross. We will see this Sunday as well in the Royal Rumble matchup. Cedric's got all the tools to be a success here on Monday Night Raw. He's a former Cruiserweight champion, a former tag team champion. Let's see if he can get it done tonight against Mr. Monday Night himself. Gotta stay focused when you're in there with someone the caliber of RVD. What a maneuver there by Cedric. Alexander's got such an impressive tool of arsenals. Off that springboard kick, showcasing his attributes here tonight. And misses for the day. RVD had it scouted there. Oh, and what a super kick by the whole damn show. An emphatic kick, if I ever saw one. As we mentioned, RVD went one-on-one -on -one with AJ Styles just a few weeks back here on Raw. It was a number one contender's matchup to determine who. Oh, what a drop kick by Cedric. I have to cut myself off there. Cedric now into the cover off the drop kick. Very impressive maneuver. Had all his weight behind that one. Got a two count there, but RVD gets the shoulder up. As we were mentioning, RVD came up short against AJ Styles in the matchup to determine who would fight Randy Orton for the WWE Championship. I'm sure RVD is still thinking about that loss. I'm sure RVD still wants to bounce back and get himself a WWE Championship matchup. And that very well may be through the Royal Rumble. Imagine RVD at this stage in his career, a WWE Hall of Famer. Imagine him winning the Royal Rumble matchup and moving on to the main event of WrestleMania. That is very much a possibility. Mr. Monday Night, one of the top players here on Monday Night Raw, and he's showcasing why. Split-legging moonsault by the Hall of Famer into the cover, but Cedric again gets the shoulder up. Impressive maneuver by RVD. Wait a minute here. Classic RVD incoming. Goes for the rolling thunder, but Alexander gets the knees up. Nice counter by Cedric there. Tries to go behind. Could have been going for the lumbar check. RVD now counters into the pinfall. Will that do it? And Cedric able to bounce back. Yeah, what a matchup we got here tonight in the Toyota Center in Houston. RVD and Cedric giving this audience a show here tonight on Raw. Cedric sent into the corner, avoiding whatever RVD had in mind. Disaster, and Cedric Alexander, Spanish fly out of nowhere. Don't count out Cedric in the ring. Not enough to pull RVD away just yet, but the damage certainly done on his opposer. Impressive maneuver by Cedric, but RVD tough as nails even at this point in his career. We know the long list of things that RVD has been through throughout his career. Going to take a lot to keep down the whole damn show. Van Damme trying to bounce back. But you got to imagine he's hurting off that Spanish fly. Nice dra arm drag, excuse us. RVD better not showcase himself too much here. Going to get himself caught. Cedric goes behind. RVD now goes behind. Wait a minute, boys and Rana. My goodness. 
RVD showing up and showing out tonight. Now, wait a minute. Rolling Thunder this time nails it flush. Into the cover by Mr. Monday Night. Will that do it? Dead center of the ring, but Cedric Alexander holds on again. A gutsy performance tonight by Cedric Alexander. Hanging in there against RVD. Alexander knows what's hanging on the line right now. He's trying to make a name for himself on his own once again here on Raw. He wants to earn a spot in the Royal Rumble matchup. A win over RVD could do just that. Cedric on the top rope right now. RVD got something in mind here. Wheels are turning and a superplex sends Cedric Alexander down to the canvas. Um, oh, wait a minute, Van Dam's heading up top. I think we know what's coming. Five star frog splash. Cover. An impressive victory by Mr. Monday Night here in Houston. And that was one hell of a contest. Gotta give credit where credit's due. Cedric Alexander showcasing his abilities, showcasing the heart and soul that he's got deep down in that body tonight. Wait a minute here. Cedric extending the hand to RVD. You love to see it after a competitive matchup that, like that. Respect shown between Alexander and RVD. But Mr. Monday Night picks up the victory and could Rob Van Dam be getting ready to punch his ticket to WrestleMania this Sunday? This Sunday night, live from the Scotia Bank Arena in Toronto, Ontario, Canada, it is the live premiere of Royal Rumble, January 1st, 2023, 5 p.m. Eastern Time, and it is a stacked night of action from Friday Night SmackDown. The Cruiserweight Championship will be on the line as the man who's held the gold since the month of June, Ricochet, puts it up against one of the all-time greats, Rey Mysterio, one-on-one -on -one for the Cruiserweight Championship. And in the Friday Night SmackDown main event at the Royal Rumble, John Cena is chasing number 17. Will the franchise be able to topple the visionary? Two men who got a lot of history with each other battle it out over the World Heavyweight Championship. The WWE Women's Tag Team Championship for Monday Night Raw will be defended as the boss and glow, Sasha Banks and Naomi, look to take away the gold from Candice LeRae and Indy Hartwell of the way. It's 2v2 this Sunday. It is the third and final meeting between the Empress of Tomorrow, Asuka, and the ballsy badass Shotzi. A rivalry that's been brewing since SummerSlam finally comes to an end at the Royal Rumble for the Women's Championship. As we found out earlier tonight, DIY has punched their ticket, and they're looking to walk into the same building where they once held NXT Tag Team Championship gold, and they're looking to leave the WWE Tag Team Championship. They take on Priest and Dijakovic this Sunday. It is gonna be a hometown affair as Edge returns to Toronto to take on the prize fighter, Kevin Owens, the man who tried to put him on the shelf for good on the Raw after Survivor Series. It's no holds barred in Toronto for Edge and Kevin Owens. The Monday Night Raw main event, the WWE Championship is on the line. The number one contender, the phenomenal, AJ Styles meets the Apex Predator, the Viper, the Legend Killer, Randy Orton. And then of course, 15 superstars from Raw, 15 superstars from SmackDown. It is the 30-man Royal Rumble match. And the winner punches their ticket to the main event of WrestleMania. Who will be the one? Who will be the last man standing this Sunday at the Royal Rumble? That is coming up on Sunday night, but it is main event time here from the Toyota Center in Houston on your final Monday Night Raw before this Sunday night's festivities. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Marieville, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 266 pounds, Kevin It was on the Raw after Survivor Series where Kevin Owens returned from injury to ambush the rated R superstar Edge in the backstage area. He put Edge on the shelf for weeks after Edge was already nursing injuries from Hell in the Cell at Survivor Series. 
Edge returned on Saturday Night's Main Event a few weeks ago, laid out Kevin Owens, and last week laid out the challenge for Toronto. No holds barred, first time ever. Kevin Owens at Edge, one-on-one, -on -one, and there's gonna be absolutely anything goes, and a whole lot of payback is on the mind of the rated R superstar. Kevin Owens was looking to remind the WWE Universe just who the hell he was, but he might have did it on the wrong person's behalf. He's got Edge this Sunday, but he's got the original bro here tonight on Raw. Riddle's been picking up some steam as of late. Victories over the Nigerian Giant Omas, a victory over Jinder Mahal a few weeks ago. Can Riddle pick up another one on the road to the Rumble? And his opponent from Las Vegas, Nevada, weighing in at 216 pounds, Riddle. Matt Riddle, we have questioned whether this is the same man who once held Tag Team Championship gold with the current WWE Champion Randy Orton. We once questioned if this is the same man who took NXT black and gold by storm upon his arrival in the WWE. Riddle is looking to answer a lot of those questions the last number of weeks. He's looking to silence a lot of the doubters, and he could very well do just that if Riddle can be the one to go to WrestleMania. We will find out this Sunday night, but it is main event time here on Raw. What an all-star meeting between two of Raw's top superstars, KO Riddle, one-on-one -on -one here tonight. And I'm sure the rated R superstar Edge, who from what we understand is already home in Toronto, preparing for the Royal Rumble. I'm sure he's got his eyes locked on this matchup against Kevin Owens and Matt Riddle, trying to scout his opponent for this Sunday night. Will be the first time ever meeting between Kevin Owens and Riddle. And you know, Kevin Owens really has said very little about the whole Edge situation. From what we understand, from what we can piece together, Kevin Owens looks at Edge as basically wrong place, wrong time. And he looks at the Hall of Famer as the guy he was trying to remind, I should say, trying to use to remind the WWE Universe just what the hell Kevin Owens was capable of after spending so many months on the shelf due to injury. At the end of the day, whether you like Kevin Owens or not, he may have pissed off the wrong son of a bitch. The rated R superstar, the ultimate opportunist, is coming into his hometown, his backyard of Toronto, Ontario, Canada. His first matchup since Hell in a Cell at Survivor Series. And there's anything goes, Kevin Owens better be careful come this Sunday. Owens working over Riddle. And as we were mentioning, Riddle going to be one of the 15 Raw superstars in the 30-man Royal Rumble matchup. Imagine if Matt Riddle can win the Royal Rumble, move on to WrestleMania to fight whomever is the WWE Champion for Monday Night Raw. For all superstars competing for that WWE title shot, SmackDown superstars competing for that World Championship shot. It's all about getting to the main event of WrestleMania. Kevin Owens takes Riddle to the outside here. The ball gonna go at it. KO, Matt Riddle going at it on the outside of the ring. Riddle unloading on the prize fighter. What a kick to the side of the head. Kevin Owens has only had two matches since returning from injury. One against Big E at Raw Homecoming, one against Montez Ford back on Saturday night's main event. Been successful in both of them. Will his luck continue here today on Raw? What a night it's gonna be this Sunday at the Royal Rumble. WWE Championship on the line, AJ Styles, who has been absolutely unstoppable as of late, came up short against Karrion Cross last week on Raw due to the distraction from Randy Orton, but you still can't knock with AJ Styles, the repertoire, I should say the resume, he has been putting together just the last few weeks here on Raw. He's absolutely earned himself that championship opportunity against Randy Orton for the gold this Sunday night, the Raw main event at the Royal Rumble. Of course, the SmackDown main event will feature the World Heavyweight Championship, the franchise player John Cena chasing number 17 in his WWE career as he goes one-on-one -on -one with the visionary, Seth freaking Rollins for the World Heavyweight title. 30-man Royal Rumble matchup, Asuka and Shotzi concluding a near six-month rivalry this Sunday night. It is a stacked night, no doubt our biggest live premiere event and we have done yet here on the No Nation Gaming YouTube channel. You're not going to want to miss it. 5 p.m. Eastern time. What a night it's going to be in Toronto. Back to the action inside of the ring. Kevin Owens and Matt Riddle continuing this brawl here tonight in Houston. Owens taking a minute to soak in 
I wouldn't necessarily say the adulation as Riddle went for that springboard kick and Kevin Owens had it scouted. Riddle off into the corner on a clothesline by the prize fighter. Owens is looking to make a statement tonight. It's about building momentum, but it's also about showcasing the edge what Kevin Owens is capable of ahead of no holds barred this Sunday. Swinging neckbreaker takes out the original bro. KO into the cover. Riddle gets the shoulder up with the damage certainly done in a maneuver like that. What a night it's been here on Monday Night Raw. We kicked it off with the World Tag Team Championship Eliminator DIY punching their ticket to the Rumble. They will meet Damian Priest and Dominic Dijakovic this Sunday night. Of course, Asuka and Shotzi are both in action tonight, both picking up singles victories ahead of their meeting at the Rumble. Rob Van Dam and Cedric Alexander moments ago tearing down the house here in Houston, and Riddle is tearing it up with Kevin Owens right now off that exploder. KO's days, Riddle's got to capitalize here. Oh, and just a slap to the face by Kevin Owens, and Riddle not taken very lightly. What a kick to the side of the head. And I could be looking for that bro mission that has paid Matt Riddle dividends in recent victories. Got KO all tied up, maybe a little early in the matchup to keep somebody the caliber of Kevin Owens down for good. But the damage certainly done. The bell's got to be wrong of Kevin Owens after that kick to the side of the head and the bro mission there. Not sure if Riddle had it locked in tight. At the end of the day, Kevin Owens escapes from the main event here in Houston, rolls on. Now KO with a shot, with a shot to the side of the head of Matt Riddle. Now another one here. KO doesn't give a damn who you are, where you've been, inside of that ring. He's about one man, and that's himself. No calling the prize fighter for nothing. And a senton there, he is beating the living hell out of Matt Riddle right now. KO not looking to come up short ahead of his first time ever meeting with the Hall of Famer this Sunday. Matt Riddle down and out, Kevin Owens here, going for the splash and he connects. Into the cover by KO, Riddle gets the shoulder up and Monday Night Raw's main event rolls on. Now the beatdown commences. I'm sure Kevin Owens is getting a little furious here. Not able to put Riddle away just yet. KO had more dominating victories over Big E and Montez Ford in his last two matches. Matt Riddle tonight giving KO a little bit more of a run for his money. Oh, wait a minute. Packaging him up here. Oh, no. Counter by the bro. And a clothesline there. Momentum shifts back in the corner of Matt Riddle. Riddle not looking to come up short ahead of the Royal Rumble matchup. Wait a minute, Riddle, Riddle. I think he's going back for that bro mission, and he is just that. And Riddle's got it wrenched in tight here for the second time in the matchup. Bro mission on Kevin Owens. Will it be enough here? Oh, KO again is able to break the grip. And you know, Riddle's starting to do some damage off those submission holes, but Kevin Owens has really been the aggressor for the majority of this matchup. You gotta believe that's why Matt Riddle has not been able to put Kevin Owens away just yet. Riddle on the apron here, Kevin Owens with a shot. Able to avoid disaster. The disaster being the tap out of the bro mission. Now Riddle's down in the ring. Owens is going back up to the top rope. Riddle's getting to his feet. Riddle guys after him. KO went for the cross body and no one home. Riddle goes behind. Snap German on Kevin Owens. Momentum shifts back to the bro right now who is unloading on the prize fighter. We got a barn burner going on inside the ring right now. And look at the strength from Matt Riddle. One suplex, not enough. The bro's looking to make a statement tonight on Raw. Another one and he lets go with it. Whether you like Kevin Owens or not, he's in there tearing it up with Matt Riddle right now. What a main event we got on deck. Back and forth, the momentum shifts in this main event matchup. And now Owens with a super kick to Riddle. Hits the ropes. Running head start with the senton that time. Looking to crush the rib cage of the original bro. KO is just beating the hell out of Riddle right now. As we mentioned, Edge already back in his hometown of Toronto preparing for the Royal Rumble this Sunday night. I'm sure he's got his eyes locked on this matchup between Kevin Owens and Matt Riddle. 
They're going to put a strategy together for no holds barred. Owens avoiding whatever Riddle had in mind there. Could have been some kind of diving forearm. Wait a minute, Riddle with the counter. Nice kick to KO. And a forearm to Kevin Owens. Eating the hell out of each other tonight in H-Town. KO survives. Riddle got to be questioning what it's going to take to put Kevin Owens down tonight after he's already hit not one, but two bro missions. Springboard drop kick sends Kevin Owens flipping inside out. There's another kick. Wait a minute. It's the third time gonna be a charm. Kevin Owens is in trouble. Bro mission again in this matchup. KO's got nowhere to go. And KO taps out here on Raw. Matt Riddle picking up a victory. What a win for the original bro. It took not one, not two, but three attempts, but he gets the prize fighter to tap out that center of the ring. Well, I don't know how that's going to affect Kevin Owens' psyche heading into the Royal Rumble against Edge this Sunday night. But as for that man, the original bro, he is all momentum, all full steam ahead, heading towards this Sunday's 30-man Royal Rumble matchup. It is a live premiere, New Year's night, 5 p.m. Eastern time, so Scotiabank, Toronto, here we come. We will see you at the Royal Rumble. Pace on when I chase like that, yeah, I play so strong with a knife in the back. I'm a swing home run like a baseball bat. Gonna see me rise, you can hate on that. I don't play both sides, doing me no cap. I'm a rider.